thing for tonight. Uh, and if later the want something else, I've already read, but I could read it again. But my one contribution for tonight is a poem, which I normally don't do. <clears throat> Debbie helped me, so this is what I've come up with after we talk. It's called, I Am From. I am from ideas filling broad, blank spaces with hues and shades, pieces of my soul. From pungent, odorous turpentine and stubby, bristly brushes. From the wetness, the coolness, the earth, coaxing forth its secrets forever frozen in the fire. I am from the pounding rhythm, the streaming ribbon pa paper ribbon, the spinning drums repeating, the pitch blackness laid upon their faces, sending daily volumes to the masses waiting. <clears throat> I am from the pen, filling paper with words escaping inner depths, speaking volumes to hungry eyes, dreams of love, flights of fancy, tears of joy and laughter, to warm, to touch, inspire, igniting the passion of their soul. This is a short one. Uh, I think I read it last year, but I'm not sure. But I had re I've rewritten part of it, so it maybe it'll be a little different. It's called The Christmas Pageant. The sanctuary overhead lights drop down to a soft glow, and a hush falls over the moms and pops, grams and gramps, Aunt Sue's and Uncle Jim's, all tightly packed into the pews from the front to the back. Little Jamie Rourke takes his position at the podium. He adjusts his choir robe and raises his hand, giving the signal for the profession, procession to start. The doors at the back of the sanctuary swing wide, and Mrs. Johnson begins playing O Little Town of Bethlehem on the church piano as a band of tow-headed angels with twinkling tinsel halos, robes of old white bedsheets sprinkled with glitter, and wings of white tissue paper glued to wing-shaped wires march solemnly down the aisle. We watch with pride as our little Billy Gilbert keeps in step with the music. Next comes Bobby Stevens. He's playing Joseph this year. A new piece of hemp holds his dad's old brown chenille robe snugly at his waist. The hem is held up with six or so silver safety pins. And a white bath towel draped over his head is held in place with an old headband from his sister. Bobby pulls his brand new red flyer wagon carrying this year's Mary. Alice Gentry. She is dressed in a piece of baby blue flannel and her mother's white scarf on her head. She holds her doll baby wrapped in her baby sister's old blanket safely in her arms. Then the shepherds with their staffs of stiff cardboard painted brown wearing striped robes made from the bolt of material donated by the local mercantile walk through the doors. Next the three kings their robes made from the same bolt of material and their cardboard crowns covered in tinfoil, reflecting the light off glued on jewels from pieces of old broken jewelry. All marching somewhat in step up to the front and fill it, filing one by one on the stage. The band of angels climbed up the risers in the back and Mary and Joseph, the shepherds and the three kings take their places in front of the risers. Jamie starts telling the story of old when I noticed a bobbing head in the angels band bouncing up and down, back and forth, hopping from one foot to the other. A none too quiet, I gotta go, reverberates from the back of the stage, followed by, I told you to go before we started, hissed from somewhere off stage. Snickers fluttered through the audience. I gotta go, really bad, the angel says again. That's when I see it's our Billy. All knock kneed and prancing. More snickers as I scoot down in my seat. You'll just have to hold it, comes off the stage raspy command. My wife, sitting next to me, tenses and grabs my arm, her nails digging in. I know what that means. I hold my breath. The prancing stops, and I watch as Billy knowingly smiles. A small silver stream flows swiftly across the stage and catches the light. It sparkles brightly as it trickles over the edge and pulls in front of the Reverend Martin Black. He shifts in the pew, moves his feet over, then smiles and softly says, sometimes even angels can't wait. Oh. <laughs>